Morning folks. This is a response to uh, Mr. Sly Red Fox and his video uh, just talking stuff. Brother, I agree with you. Things are getting worse. They're not getting any better. I miss the way things used to be as well. I grew up in the 60s and 70s. Back then, there was such a thing as community. Where people would get together and help out somebody who's had a misfortune or whatnot. No one would ask. We would just show up and do whatever we could. We had a tornado go through, it was the latter part of the 60s, up on the hill. And it took the top of a barn off a farm up on top of the hill from us. And, well, the only thing that managed to save the cows was that it was sort of, the main part of the barn was sort of underground. There were ramps on either side of the barn, earthen ramps all along. Took the tire top right off the barn. <laughs> Cows, their milk wasn't for shit for weeks. But I can remember that was on a Wednesday or Thursday. And I can remember on Friday Dad getting home from work and he'd load us all in and we went up to that farm and we started clearing, cleaning up. The very next day people started coming in with lumber, hay, all sorts of stuff. And <laughs> literally in a month of Sundays Within a month, we had the barn up again. I remember having a barn dance. I miss those days. People pitched in and worked together. Days are long gone. As far as where we're going now, I've had a couple glimmers of hopeful change. Maybe things could get better. First one was the tea party. about the time I was ready to say, okay, yep, yeah, I'm with you. It got corrupted by, well, Glenn Beck and Sarah Palin. Another one was this Occupy Wall Street. And I'll see if I can find the video. I'm sure you've all seen it before, but I'll put it down in the crotch bar. <coughs> I thought there was some hope. They had an out. This young man was a very outstanding speaker. But now that's even gotten corrupted. Unions and their list of demands. I get real. I do see things getting ugly down there. I'm checking out our own state's Occupy. 
I'm just waiting to see what their demands are. If it's wacky shit like Wall Street, no, I won't be a part of that either. I have dreams. Most dreams I don't remember. But the ones I do. What I'm seeing in my dreams, what's coming, is very ugly. It's not a pretty world out there. Not at all. I still have one hope, but that's with Ron Paul. But to be honest with you, if he gets elected, you've got to see who's going to be his vice. Because I can see JFK happening to him. Just some thoughts. Peace out.